at this point, I'm gonna say this this video involves me tearing off my shirt. Okay, so I was watching like videos about people who got insane tattoos at some point, and um, I'm gonna tell you the story of mine. Uh, huh. So many years ago, I moved out into my first place, and a very old friend of mine also born in the month of August, which basically, you know, I don't know if it's an astrological thing or it's a um, climate thing, maybe, this is the middle of winter, but basically, you know, you're, at the very least, if you're born in that month, you're an extreme egotist, okay, and you take astrology seriously. Anyway, this friend of mine is also born in August, but like, further back, more Virgo and, and so, you know, maybe a bit more, um, not gonna be a vlogger, how's that for an idea, okay. Anyway, he comes up from Sydney to like warm my house for me in the first few weeks of me moving out. And <laughs> being born in the month of August, he has a bunch of friends, like old friends, and they all come around and like they're hanging out. And one of these people that he knows, he comes over and we're getting drunk and I'm getting drunk. And I don't really get that drunk that often yet. I did it last night. It's, I look all like rotten at the moment. Anyway. <laughs> so, this this video involves me tearing off my shirt, you know, this, specifically this poncho which was given to me by this friend of mine that I'm talking about, who, yeah, okay, so, this friend of his comes over and on his non-dominant arm, I'm not quite sure which one it was again, he has the shittest rose tattoo anyone has ever performed on anyone, and, he's, and I've gone, wait, so dude, do you have your own gun, like, have you done this to yourself, and he's like, fuck yeah man, Dope as fuck, right? Like this. And like, like <laughs> because I'm a bit tipsy, I go, all right, dude, let's get it on. Let's like fucking get your gun out and like give each other tattoos like this. And like, and it's like, and and and, and he's like, I'm not gonna give you a tattoo, man. I, I I don't feel comfortable doing that. But like, my friend, who's like the, the poncho guy, and also my old August buddy from way back when. He's come up to visit me. He's like, no, nah, we're doing this. And you gotta commit to it. And I was the same. I was like very committed to the idea of it. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, I decided that I was gonna get the lyrics, kill it better. Those motherfuckers can just suck it up from a song that I wrote called Swamp many years ago. I'll upload the song at some point. Um, probably tear my shirt off during it as well. But anyway, okay, so I get, so, you know, the time comes, the gun is there, you know, we're drunk enough and all this sort of stuff. And he decides he's not going to get something stupid tattooed where I decided to get it tattooed. He's just going to get, you know, the, the words definitely giants tattooed on his foot. Because he is also, uh, you know, a, a more minor fan of They Might Be Giants than I am. <laughs> uh, how does this go? Alright, so there's like five or six people there. But anyway, so like they might have been on meth, which was like sort of like up in the sort of sociopathy of the um, whole crew. And um... <laughs> Anyway, so, okay, this is the bit where, um, ah, 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 tear off my shirt, and this, okay, so it starts, where does it start? It starts there, that's like the first line. This guy, who did this tattoo, obviously had never done a tattoo before in his life, right? And so, <laughs> yeah, um, and, and it, like, he, he fucked it up real hard, like, he was being a fucking asshole about it, like, we sort of did a basic design, and I was telling him, nowhere near the nipple, do not go anywhere the fuck near my nipple, I'm a very, very ticklish person, nipple's no good, okay, so anyway, he's gotten, like, right close to the nipple, like, I was screaming for them to stop on the first line, he didn't know what he was doing, he feels bad about it now, which is proof that he isn't such a bad person, but anyway, we were drunk, and I was drunk, and I'd agreed to do this, and so, I got the, yeah. By about here, I'm screaming, I'm crying, I'm telling them to stop, and they got the whole the fuck way through it. It was like, hours of work, and, and it's so shit. Like, just so horrendously terrible, this tattoo. You know, like, you get what you get when you're a fucking idiot. Yeah. I'm gonna put my, my shirt back on just so I can tear it back off again. Okay.